Britt Eklund is a Swedish actress and singer who gained fame in the 1970s as a sex symbol. Her bold performance in the film The Wicker Man and her high-profile relationship with Peter Sellers contributed to her popularity. Despite being associated with glamour and scandal, Eklund established herself as a serious actress, appearing in numerous films and television shows. Her impact on 70s pop culture is still felt today. Britt Eklund is a Swedish actress, best known for her role as Willow in the 1973 film The Wicker Man. In this film, Eklund's character is known for her provocative scenes, which marked many viewers' first exposure to on-screen female nudity. This cultural milestone set a new standard for cinematic nudity and established Eklund as a bold and daring actress. Eklund's performance in The Wicker Man was a defining moment in her career, and it remains one of her most memorable roles. Her portrayal of Willow was both captivating and controversial, leaving a lasting impression on audiences and critics alike. Despite the film's mixed reception upon its initial release, it has since become a cult classic, and Eklund's performance is widely regarded as one of its standout elements. In addition to her work in The Wicker Man, Eklund has had a long and varied career in both film and television. She has appeared in numerous productions, including the popular TV series The New Avengers and the James Bond film The Man with the Golden Gun. Throughout her career, Eklund has demonstrated her versatility and talent as an actress, earning a reputation as a respected and accomplished performer. Eklund's contributions to the world of entertainment have left a lasting impact, and her work continues to be celebrated and admired by audiences around the world. Her role in The Wicker Man remains a cultural milestone, and it serves as a testament to her bold and daring approach to acting. Despite the passage of time, Eklund's performance in this film continues to resonate with audiences, and it remains a defining moment in the history of cinematic nudity. Britt Eklund, the Swedish actress, married British actor Peter Sellers in 1964. However, their marriage was far from harmonious. Eklund has described it as tumultuous, marked by emotional and psychological abuse. Sellers was known for his eccentric behavior and struggled with insecurities, which often manifested in their relationship. One of the most challenging aspects of their marriage for Eklund was the isolation she experienced. Sellers was possessive and jealous, often preventing her from seeing friends or family. This manipulative behavior took a toll on Eklund, leaving her feeling trapped and alone. In addition to the isolation, Eklund discovered that Sellers had been secretly recording their conversations. This breach of trust was the final straw in their already strained relationship, and the couple divorced in 1968. Eklund has spoken publicly about the abuse she suffered during her marriage to Sellers, hoping to raise awareness about the signs of emotional and psychological manipulation. Despite the challenges she faced during their marriage, Eklund has continued to work as an actress and has remained a prominent figure in the entertainment industry. After Britt Eklund's divorce in 1975, she began a high-profile relationship with Rod Stewart, the well-known British singer. Their relationship was marked by media attention and numerous social appearances together. Eklund and Stewart were a popular couple, often seen at events and in the headlines. However, their relationship came to an end in 1977 due to their busy schedules and lifestyle differences. Despite the attention and excitement that came with their relationship, they ultimately found it difficult to maintain due to their individual commitments and differing ways of living. Eklund and Stewart's relationship, while short-lived, was a significant one in the world of celebrity romance. It was marked by glamour and excitement, but ultimately could not withstand the pressures of their demanding careers and differing lifestyles. Britt Eklund, the Swedish actress, was involved in a brief but intense relationship with Warren Beatty in the late 1960s. Eklund, who was already a successful actress, found herself drawn to Beatty's charm and charisma. However, their relationship was fraught with difficulties, particularly due to Beatty's infidelities and lack of commitment. Eklund has spoken openly about the challenges she faced in her relationship with Beatty. She struggled with his wandering eye and his refusal to settle down. Despite her best efforts, she was unable to keep him faithful, and the relationship eventually came to an end. Despite the heartache that Eklund experienced during her time with Beatty, she has spoken fondly of him in interviews. She has described him as a charming and charismatic man, and has acknowledged the impact that he had on her life. Eklund's relationship with Beatty was just one part of her long and successful career in the entertainment industry. 
She has appeared in numerous films and television shows over the years and has earned a reputation as a talented and versatile actress. Throughout her career, Eklund has remained a private and guarded person, preferring to keep her personal life out of the public eye. However, her relationship with Warren Beatty remains a notable chapter in her life and serves as a reminder of the challenges that can come with fame and celebrity. In spite of the difficulties that she faced in her relationship with Beatty, Eklund has continued to work in the entertainment industry and has built a lasting legacy as a talented and respected actress. Her contributions to the world of film and television have been significant and she will always be remembered for her talent, her beauty, and her resilience in the face of adversity. Britt Eklund, a well-known actress, married Stray Cats drummer Slim Jim Phantom in 1984. Their marriage lasted for eight years until 1992. During this time, Eklund was in her mid-40s, while Phantom was in his early 20s. Their union was relatively unconventional, given their age difference and the fact that Eklund was a successful actress, while Phantom was a rising star in the music industry. Despite the challenges that come with such a significant age gap and differences in their respective careers, Eklund and Phantom's marriage was characterized by mutual respect and admiration. Eklund has spoken fondly of Phantom in interviews, praising his talent and energy. Similarly, Phantom has expressed his admiration for Eklund's acting prowess and career accomplishments. The two met in 1982 when Eklund attended a Stray Cats concert in Los Angeles. They struck up a conversation after the show, and their friendship quickly turned into a romantic relationship. Eklund was drawn to Phantom's youthful energy and rebellious spirit, while Phantom was captivated by Eklund's beauty, talent, and charm. Eklund and Phantom's wedding took place in Las Vegas in 1984. The ceremony was a small, intimate affair attended by close friends and family. Eklund wore a white gown, while Phantom donned a black suit and sunglasses. The newlyweds honeymooned in Hawaii, where they enjoyed the sun, sand, and surf. Throughout their marriage, Eklund and Phantom collaborated on various projects. Eklund appeared in several of the Stray Cats music videos, including Stray Cat Strut and Rock This Town. Phantom, in turn, contributed to the soundtrack of Eklund's 1987 film, The Slugger's Wife. Despite their efforts to maintain a strong relationship, Eklund and Phantom ultimately decided to part ways in 1992. The split was amicable, and the two have remained on good terms. Eklund has since remarried, while Phantom has continued to pursue his music career. In conclusion, Britt Eklund's marriage to Slim Jim Phantom was a significant event in her personal life. Their union, which lasted from 1984 to 1992, was characterized by mutual admiration and respect despite their age difference and differences in their respective careers. Eklund and Phantom's marriage was marked by collaboration and creativity, and their legacy as a couple continues to resonate in the entertainment industry. Britt Eklund, a Swedish actress, started her acting career in Britain during the 1960s. She quickly gained significant attention in the film industry with her notable roles in The Double Man in 1967 and The Night They Raided Minsky's in 1968. These films showcased her acting skills and helped establish her as a promising actress in Britain. In The Double Man, Eklund played a key role alongside stars Joel Brenner and Britt Eklund, demonstrating her ability to hold her own alongside seasoned actors. The film was a spy thriller, and Eklund's portrayal of a vulnerable yet strong character was widely appreciated. Similarly, in The Night They Raided Minsky's, Eklund showcased her comedic timing and versatility as an actress. The film was a musical comedy set in the early 19s, and Eklund played a leading role delivering a memorable performance that highlighted her range as an actress. Eklund's early success in Britain paved the way for her to take on more challenging roles in the future. Her ability to adapt to different genres and work with a variety of actors established her as a respected and bankable actress in the industry. Throughout her career, Eklund continued to take on diverse roles, further solidifying her status as a talented actress. Her contributions to the film industry have left a lasting impact and her performances continue to be celebrated by audiences and critics alike. In conclusion, Britt Eklund's acting career began in the 1960s in Britain and she quickly made a name for herself with notable roles in films like The Double Man and The Night They Raided Minsky's. Her ability to adapt to different genres and work with a variety of actors established her as a respected and bankable actress in the industry. Her contributions to the film industry have left a lasting impact and her performances continue to be celebrated by audiences and critics alike. Britt Eklund, born on October 6, 1942 in Sweden, is a renowned actress 
who gained international fame for her role as the Bond girl Mary Goodnight in the 1974 film The Man with the Golden Gun. Eklund's portrayal of the glamorous and intelligent Mary Goodnight further established her as a sex symbol and solidified her place in cinema history. Before her iconic role in the James Bond franchise, Eklund began her acting career in Sweden, appearing in several films and television shows. In 1964, she made her international film debut in Guns at Patasi, which earned her a Golden Globe nomination for New Star of the Year. Eklund's beauty and charm quickly caught the attention of Hollywood, leading to roles in high-profile films such as The Night They Raided Minsky's and Get Carter. In The Man with the Golden Gun, Eklund's character, Mary Goodnight, is a British agent who assists Bond in his mission to take down a rogue agent. Eklund's performance was praised for her comedic timing and chemistry with co-star Roger Moore. Her portrayal of Goodnight was both glamorous and intelligent, showcasing Eklund's range as an actress. Eklund's career continued to flourish after her role in the Bond film, appearing in numerous television shows and films. She starred alongside Chuck Norris in The Octagon and worked with famed director William Friedkin in Cruising. Eklund also appeared in several Italian films, showcasing her versatility as an actress. Throughout her career, Eklund has been open about her personal life, including her high-profile relationships with stars such as Peter Sellers and Rod Stewart. Despite the challenges she faced in her personal life, Eklund remained dedicated to her craft, continuing to act in film and television. Today, Britt Eklund is remembered for her iconic role as Mary Goodnight in The Man with the Golden Gun and her contributions to the world of cinema. Her legacy as a Bond girl and sex symbol continues to resonate with audiences, cementing her place in film history. Britt Eklund, the Swedish actress, continued to make her mark in the film, television, and theater industries. In 1971, she starred in the British crime film, Dick Carter, which became a classic in the genre. Her performance was well received and added another feather to her cap. A few years later, in 1973, Eklund appeared in the horror film, The Wicker Man. Her role in this film is considered one of her most memorable performances. The film has since gained a cult following, and Eklund's performance is often highlighted as a key element of its success. In 1989, Eklund took on a role in the political drama Scandal, which was based on the true story of a British political sex scandal. The film was a critical and commercial success, and Eklund's performance was praised. Apart from her work in films and television, Eklund also ventured into music. In 1968, she released a self-titled album, showcasing her singing talents. The album was well received and added another dimension to her already impressive career. In conclusion, Britt Eklund's career continued to flourish in the film, television, and music industries. Her contributions to these fields are still celebrated today, and her legacy continues to inspire aspiring actors and musicians. Britt Eklund, the renowned actress, has always shown a deep commitment to philanthropy. She has used her platform to support various causes, with a particular focus on animal rights and helping children with disabilities. Eklund's work in these areas highlights her dedication to making a positive impact on the world. In recent years, Eklund has emphasized personal growth and independence in her philanthropic efforts. She believes that empowering individuals to take control of their own lives is a crucial step in creating lasting change. By supporting organizations that promote independence and self-sufficiency, Eklund hopes to create a ripple effect that will benefit communities as a whole. Eklund's work in animal rights is especially close to her heart. She is a passionate advocate for the humane treatment of animals and has worked with numerous organizations to promote animal welfare. Whether it's speaking out against animal cruelty or supporting conservation efforts, Eklund is committed to making a difference in the lives of animals around the world. In addition to her work in animal rights, Eklund has also been a strong supporter of children with disabilities. She understands that these children often face unique challenges and has worked to provide them with the resources and support they need to thrive. By promoting inclusivity and accessibility, Eklund hopes to create a more equitable world for all children, regardless of their abilities. Through her philanthropic efforts, Britt Eklund has shown that she is not just a talented actress, but also a compassionate and committed advocate for positive change. Her work in animal rights and supporting children with disabilities is a testament to her dedication to making the world a better place, one person or animal at a time.